So early on, we were one of the first big advocates to cancel Netflix because of their controversial film, Cuties. No, Netflix is not voluntarily taking this show down. Despite all the public backlash, they have decided to take a philosophical stand in the name of art to keep this content live. Or is it art? Here's the deal. Controversy sells. Just like big tech, profit is more important than ethics. We wrote an article early on wondering why there wasn't official action by the FBI. I mean, this is child pornography. We suggested that there should be a criminal investigation into this clear instance of the sexualization of 11-year-old girls for profit in the name of entertainment. A few weeks later, we're excited to say that a district court in Tyler, Texas has filed an indictment against Netflix. Boom. This injunction said that Netflix knowingly prompted visual material which depicted the lewd exhibition of the genitals or pubic area of a clothed or partially clothed child who is younger than 18 years of age. This appeals to the interest of sex, has no serious literary, artistic, political, or scientific value. We couldn't agree more. In fact, you could have copied that almost verbatim from the blog post that we wrote. Now, for those of you that still think the cuties isn't all that bad or say, oh, you have to watch it before you judge it, know this. We watched the film. We did this for two reasons. First, we wanted to understand if this really was actually that bad as people claimed it was. And then secondly, we wanted to silence all those folks that said, oh, you have to watch it before you judged it. We watched it. We judged it. It's terrible. We took screenshots so you could judge for yourself. Before we could post those screenshots, we had to censor them for you so we wouldn't get arrested by the FBI. We've got exposed breasts of a girl insinuated to be underage. There's young girls privately dancing provocatively for two grown men in exchange for a favor. The camera lingers focus on underage girls' cleavage, their exposed butt cheeks, their crotches. That's what the indictment's about. Over a third of the dance footage was dedicated to sensual close-up close-up shots below the waist of 11-year-old girls. This is terrible. As for us, techless, we're the people that's fighting for the creation of healthy tech and content that truly deepens relationships. We cannot continue to support Netflix. Their self-produced content, Netflix Studios, it just gets darker and darker and it pushes every boundary, morally and not legally. We're really excited that the court of Tyler's taking a stance. They're taking action. I'm not sure where this is going, but enough is enough, and we're glad that somebody is drawing a line.